What's up, YouTube? My name is uh, Jonah Crespo One. Uh, on Instagram, I'm Jonah Cichlet. I'm just doing a quick video, real quick, um, showing you a little bit of my tank here. Um, purpose of this video, I'm actually acclimating this guy right here. This is called a Rhodesia Cichlet. Um, here in the Chicago area, I only seen a few of them. They're really, really nice. This one is a small guy, he's like two inches. But you can already see colors on his. Let's see if it focuses a little bit. But you can already see colors on him coming out. Blue face, male, pointy fins. Um just picked this guy up today. Uh we'll be putting it in with my cichlids. Um so yeah, this is a quick view. Um thought I'd show you a little bit of my cichlids here. Uh getting all excited. I know it's not a good idea to put one at a time um, with my cichlids, but the way I'm going to do it today is I'm actually going to put them in, turn off the lights, um, throw in a little bit of food before I even throw them in, turn off the lights, leave them off for like two hours, and then turn on the lights and then go ahead and check them out. He should be good. Done it a couple of times in the past. Um, Nothing has ever happened. I've never had a fish die on me or be nipped like to the point that he's all like messed up. So yeah, quick video. You can see my intermediates back there. He's looking at himself in the mirror. Look, this guy this guy is looking badass. You see already he doesn't have the spots. Um so he's really comfortable here in the tank. Uh Lemon Jake right there, coloring up, really nice. Uh Lawanda back there. Deep water hap looking really good. Uh, blue Regal, this guy, I can't wait till he gets blue. He's still looking like a black. Um, can't wait till he gets all blue. Um, what else? So yeah, this is pretty much my video right now. Uh, I do have a question. Maybe um, somebody could help. Um, I kind of know the answer, but at the moment I don't have another tank to actually put him in. Uh, I had done... I had reset it, uh, the tank a couple of times. I had moved the stuff around, the rocks and everything. Um, but I can't get this guy. He was all colored up. He was all blue. Uh, I'll probably post a video later on with a with like a picture video. Um, so I put a bunch of pictures, and you can see this guy was really blue. I don't know why this guy right there. My bicolor 500. You could tell it was a male. Look at all those pointy fins. He just colored down. He was really, really intense blue. More blue than my freaking uh, Lewanda and everything. He's like really, really blue. And intense yellow. Put him in here and after like three days, he just caught it down. Um, I did see the, um, the blue neon peacock picking on him a couple of times. So I'm guessing that's the reason. But I tried resetting the tank. I tried doing a couple, doing a couple of t stuff to it. I can't get um, that bike cutter to actually cut it up. He's just dull and looking all gray. He cut it down really, really, like too much. Like right there. Um, so if you have any tips or anything else I could do, probably um, put it down in the comments. I don't have another tank right now to put him in. Uh, all my tanks are taken. I got my breeder tank and my fry tank, so don't have another tank to put him in but I do want to get this guy to color it up in my tank, my chill tank well, if I have any questions or anything just subscribe uh, also you can post him back down in the comment section uh, we doing a video once this guy is out and he's colored up I'll be doing a follow up thank you very much for watching and please up peace out